purposes. Now this is a problem all across Southern California. RVs seemingly permanently setting up camp on residential streets. People are living inside, but some neighbors want them gone. KCAL reporter Lori Perez joins us live now from Mar Vista with the latest battle in that community. Lori. Well, Pat, you might say this is a dispute between neighbors, except one side says the other should not really be their neighbors, that the RVs, like the one behind me, should not be set up on set up as homes on these Marvis on these streets. RV home rental is nothing new. It's been happening for years and the city has said RV home rental is legal as long as they follow laws about where to park and how to operate. These are the RVs pitting some people in Mar Vista houses and apartments against people in the campers turned mobile homes. We spoke via Zoom with a traditional homeowner who didn't want to share his identity because he's worried about retaliation. There's there's something fishy going on. I hate to sound like conspiratorial, but it's they're they're not destitute. They're not down on their luck. There's something there. Locals gave us these pictures of the RVs being routinely serviced with gas and water. They're worried the RVs are being rented out without oversight or codes and say they run loud generators all day long. I don't know if they're casing the neighborhood or they're, you know, hacking into somebody's, you know, internet router to, to try to steal identity or they're, you know, stealing mail. I have no idea what they're doing. We called the number in this letter posted on the RVs for anyone who has problems with them being there and connected to Dmitry Korokov, who says he's an advocate for RV dwellers. He says what's going on in these campers is low income people, mostly refugees, surviving. He says they can be rented out for about a thousand bucks a month. There is a huge uh, gap between rich and poor and uh, some neighbors doesn't like the idea of using a public street uh, that other people use as public street because they think that this neighborhood is a gated community. He says the RVers he knows stay on streets where they're allowed, they don't dump waste, and they move when asked politely, which he says rarely happens. I have a video recording of one guy. He starts screaming and saying, I will burn this motorhome. And then next day, uh, he used a BB gun to shoot in windows from his home to this motor home. Now, homeowners we spoke with have said they have tried to ask politely, and what happens is the RVs will shut off their generators and then turn them back on. When the homeowners leave, they also say they'll move, but they'll only move a few feet down the street and claim that that's enough. We are live in Mar Vista tonight. I'm Lori Perez. Back to you. All right. Thank you, Lori. I have a feeling that won't be the last we'll be hearing about that. Yeah. Okay.